Um, That's true. Start a video. <laughs> Do you be silver? Yay! Oh, what's the date is there? 27th of September. Day one. In the morning. <laughs> no, we have not. been walking for a grand total of three, four, five, six, seven, five minutes. We have been walking for five minutes. We are in River Dot and we're heading to Plume and Feathers. So, so if you Oh I'm on camera, man. Well you you can be if you want. Okay, hi guys. Hi. Doing good. Yeah. No problem so far. Okay, next bit. The, the next bit is just make, basically just making sure you don't uh, keep when you're walking on the road. Just uh, watch out for that. Bit. Just walked up a massive hill. I don't know if you can see him. Some people behind us. Do it. So, middle of the moorland, it's raining. Absolutely beautiful weather. If you look at that, look at that. Look, two young explorers, Jess, and Eddie yourself. Right, just, yeah, for the reservoir. Compass, so that the north side of the compass is pointing north here, and then you take it off, you, move, you put the red arrow on the red bit, and then that's like Hello, right, so you come to our first stumpy bit. So on the map here, if you can see it, we need to be coming down here all the way to Keemstone. But we have got stuck somewhere along the lines and we need to be finding, if you can see that little bit there, we need to be finding a river with a bridge across it. So I've took one for the team and I'm slowly walking down this here, down to the river, to see if I can find um, a bridge of some sort. If you can ask river just down there. So, I'll tell you in a minute whether I find the bridge or not. the bridge I was talking about earlier which we had to find well we found it look at that yeah basically we carried on walking that way we followed the Baron when this is actually this part here is Coombstone and we thought it was like a town so we carried on walking to houses and it wasn't it's just open moorland and now we're heading back up the hill so we're not lost we resolved it proper DAV this is and look at that look how pretty that is absolutely beautiful let's watch majestic beluga walk across this bridge go on whoa 
elegant. Climb up this little mountain here. Oh my god. Boom. Are we stopping for lunch? Just stopping for a minute, would you look at that? Nice little water break. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, Travis is just leaving his jelly here. Yeah. The jelly is mine. Stand and turn or we're probably going to come back. Right. Where are we going? Which way? Left. Leave. Go. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, Travis is just leaving his jelly here. Yeah. I'm not leaving the jelly. The jelly is mine. We are sailing. No, we are sailing across the water. That's not the right way, guys. <laughs> we are sailing. No, we are sailing across the water. That's not the right way, guys. <laughs> Just hiked up this hill. Still hiking. The river which we were set out is right in the distance over there. Right, up we go. Right, this is a mad gradient, by the way. I'm thinking like... It's a gradient of two. MX plus C. We're not the best at maths. I mean, she is. She's a bit of a nerd. She's nine seven. But we love that. We love that work ethic. And then the rest of us are all at like, the same level. Yeah. Except for Beth. Except for me, who failed maths. Except for And Beth, I think you're quite clever, aren't you? I mean, how many top sets are you in? Three. She's quite clever. So is Jess. Right, Jess let's go. Is top are you? Yeah. She's quite clever too. I'm in all it's just me, Nim, Ben, and Liv. Um, We're the dumb ones of the group. The but she's the fun one, so it's what I've said. Right, let's go. We've made it to Coombstone Tour. Moreland now, from here on out, that there, this here, is the last road we're going to see, because it's all off-road, Moreland, yeah, get our bearings correct, get our map reading correct, and we'll be good, that public footpath, and off we go, on to the Moreland. Stand still. We're getting mixed up. We can't find this footpath. Well, we think we've are the foot on the footpath, but midway through the footpath, it splits off like it's like an X. And we don't know which path to take. We've taken barrens. It's hard to take a barren like when you don't know where you are. Like we know that the general direction of Princetown is that way, but we're not sure like where to go. You know what I mean? We know that there's a river there. If you can see it, there's a river there. Um, yeah, but I'm just lying here. 
my legs are starting to go, my feet are killing. Right, back on track, back on the public footpath. Just crossing this river now. Everybody is soaking wet and cold. We need to get going. Stream. That is the river. It's just wet, everybody's soaked and we need to get there. Let's just follow the bridle path. Right. My worst nightmare's coming up. Cows. Cows scariest thing but I'm with the official cow wranglers right here apparently she's actually called Bullock that is her name because she's so brave with cows and, I, and Ben Keeley he's just a bit ballsy not scared of anything so here goes nothing the rest are great but we're in the middle of the noise raining, really raining, it's wet, but we're about three kilometres away from um, our camp, which is good news, and we should be reaching it just under an hour, um, we got past the cows, but I mean look at that, look at that, look at this weather, like, come on, Jesus! This is this is insane. Oh, this is proper windy, proper cold, you know. You know when you get rain, it's like it's half of it's like drizzled, and then the other half is like, oh, I'm wet. I'm really, really wet. That's what it's like right now. But anyway, see you in a bit. We're here. We've made it to the campsite. Ain't that right, guys? We've even got a park. We made it. Ooh, finally. Oh, guys, we made it. And we're just up there. But we're camping with another school, though. Got to show him his boss. 